peace my friend all right let's see what's going on shall we today is monday april 25th 2022 oh my god um uh, I want to wake up where you are. I won't say anything at all. That popped into my head and I was um, about to tap the record button. So there's that. Um, What you say is what you are. What you are is beautiful. Do you want to get married? I don't know. Let's see. Google Dog, right? slide what's going on behind the scenes um uh, uh, arranged marriage maybe <sighs> planning patience and planning potential all right potential oh gosh we got a karmic partner hesitation and compromise alone so there is an individual in the midst, okay, that they they do have potential if they would just get out of their hard-headed left brain is what I just got. Like, they hard-headed. Is there a smash mouth? I don't know, something about smash mouth. But we have potential, fulfillment, risk, achievement. Your potential is limitless. So whatever is happening behind the scenes, it has to do with somebody that I just feel like they just hard-headed. I'm getting hard-headed. They just hard-headed. They stubborn. They have a lot of tourists or significant placements in the second house or something like that. Somebody's hard-headed, hard to hear, hard of hearing too. Like they don't, they, you know, selective hearing, potential. Can't talk to this person. Might as well go live in a tent. I don't know. Yeah, I don't feel like this person sees that it's them. When it comes to, you know, feeling fortunate, things going in their favor, favor like um like a bounty, money, things flowing, things producing like regularly, like you know, stables, like stability. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. There's like no self develop the no self development. I feel like something is not working, like career type work, and then like working on themselves. Like they don't, they don't apply the wisdom from their lessons. They go through the same thing over and over again. They refuse to change. All right, King of Cups, the Sun card. Yo, there's happiness here. Yo, somebody is so stubborn. Like, they got their arms folded. There's an action taker here. Someone very... This is the type of person, like, when there's an emergency. Like, this person knows how to, like, you know, do first aid type. Like, they're, they they stable under pressure. They, you know, are have no, you know, a kindred, a noble heart, noble type person. King of Cups. dedicated, happy. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they are very childlike. As, as much as hard as they are, they are very happy and childlike, optimistic too. But Princess of Wands reverse, the moon in reverse, this person is purposely staying away from this person, even though there's happiness there. Ten of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Four of Cups, Six of Pentacles. Like they don't want to give Somebody has a, a problem with like they're sharing like their emotions or I just got crying. So maybe this person has a hard time crying or something about crying. They could be 
fake. I don't know. I don't know. Something like that. Somebody is purposely, you know. They got happiness right there. But they choose to stay as a, you know, karmic entity, meaning that this is the type of person, no matter who they link up with, because they know something in their mind, because they feel something in their gut, but they still force themselves to do something they know they're not supposed to do. That breeds more and more problems. That's karmic. That's 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 not going to produce anything. So anything this person touches is just going to go down because they're hard headed. I feel like they don't need, like they refuse to see it that way too. Like they refuse to see it that way. I can do what I want to do. It ain't me. It's everybody else. So the answer to this behind the scenes. So perfect timing, not the right time with this person. Ferretta, there is abundance here, an opportunity. For I, I, whatever reason, you know, I do feel like somebody, they, they just can't work with this entity. So what's happening behind the scenes is another opportunity to be successful for whatever it's hidden for. Say this is somebody that they do realize that they were once like that, but then they did do the work and that's saying, you know, this will also say too that what's happening behind the scenes is another chance. But for somebody else dealing with this, I feel like somebody's still dealing with this, like somebody just refuses. It, it, got, at just the right time, like there is abundance and an opportunity coming in. I feel this is career related, work related, something like that. Somebody's just way too hard headed. And sour, like a sour puss, like just those derelict. That's a real word, derelict. Be aware, whatever you know to be true. Eight of Swords in reverse. You know, it feels like. Especially at this, you know, this full moon energy, like building up to this, um, this new moon in Taurus, because the moon card is here. And this does talk about, I do feel this is largely around money and fortune. Be aware of, you know, again, with the eight of swords in reverse, like whoever is dealing with this entity, like, like, damn, is it me? Is it me? No. It's like, if you know you're not hard headed, you do work on yourself do self-improve you do take what other people say that like you really know you're like that and you're working with somebody that's the opposite of that very rigid just be aware of keeping your head free and knowing that it's it's not mostly you like that's stopping the situation and you know stay in that energy because new moon in taurus is about newness change around your personal finances your talents your comfortability, you know what I'm saying? And Taurus energy, it does, you know, denote some level of reliability, like with being stuck and very practical, like kind of stuck in one's ways in a little But this, this is what is, is like too much. Yeah, chariot in reverse. Be aware, you know, if there hasn't been already that with a with a chariot card in reverse, I do feel like somebody is moving out or moving away, or there is some kind of separation. Like this is no longer aligned. Like two people in their lives are no longer aligned. <clears throat> yeah, death card in reverse. Somebody is just very rigid. They want it exactly their way. All right. So the frequency to stay in. While this is happening, all right, and the, the full moon in Scorpio toward the end of May, that may be significant too because Scorpio is about intimacy, inheritance, shared resources, sex, you know, I'm saying, 
So, and you know, full moons are a blast. You're going to get hit with something to that degree. It's about mysticism or whatever. If you've been doing your, you know, staying ahead of the game. Strong water energy here. So this could be like the, this could be saying like a, a significant change around the full moon in Scorpio. Cosmic flower, all right? Prosperity, I'm telling you, the money's coming in. <clears throat> all right, so cosmic flower. The frequency of cosmic flower activates our remembrance of the place we call home, the core from which we pour our magnificence out into the world. Activates our remembrance of the place we call home. Strong Cancerian, so, you know, be comfortable at this time. Nine of Wands reverse, seven of Wands reverse. This is like saying protect your home. Like, it feels like this, you have to protect yourself from this entity, this energy. Seven of wands reverse, nine of wands reverse. That's like a fortress. That's like an energetic block, really. Protect your heart space. Protect your home, whatever it, it is. Like, you know, don't answer the phone. Don't answer the door. Just block this energy, like this rigid, unchanging energy that really causes mental confusion about what's really causing the holdup. And what it, what's causing the holdup is not applying wisdom from experiences, not improving self, you know, self-improvement, self-development. And it's very painful here with the Ten of Swords. This is painful for someone. They have to block this entity. They're very wise, they're hermit. And the Two of Pentacles, I, do, I really do feel like they wanted this person to be a part of whatever, a part of their life, a part of building something. But at this point, somebody is adamantly choosing not to ascend, not to grow. I just got not to believe. Okay. All right. So that is what I have. Okay. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Peace.